uh, innovative methods of teaching. So this is the second session of the Navadi ma'am. Uh, yesterday ma'am teach uh, how, uh, what are the ways of teaching, so what are the efficient methods, so what are the strategies of teaching methods in schools as well as in college levels and how to treat the students in an effective way. Thank you ma'am, it is very useful to all of us. So now the second session starts for uh, the second development program of innovative methods in teaching presented by Dr. Sri Tanavadi. One second, I invite you, ma'am, please. Thank you, sir. Uh, thank you, ma'am, thank you. Good morning, all of you. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, very good morning. First of all, I thanks to the management of VV College of Engineering and the principal and HOD the program coordinator and all other faculty members for giving me this opportunity. Yesterday we talked about active learning methods in teaching. So many, uh, nearly 10 methods, active learning methods we discussed about yesterday. Today we are going to see the topic Interactive, interactive, this topic, interactive based learning methods with examples. Today's learners, today's learners are Generation Z, Generation Z or 25.9 percentage of the population. In our population, nearly they are 25.9 percentage. They are the post millennial and youngest generation. Generation is it. Most tech savvy, connected and entrepreneurial generation ever. They are having more technological knowledge from birth. They are connected. So, these are the generation, types of generation. See the age 71 plus are called builders generation, builders generation. 71 plus ages, ages people are called builders. Aged 52 to 70 years called baby boomers. Generation baby boomers aged 37 to 57 are called generation Z. Sorry, X generation X. Age 22 to 36 are called generation Y. Aged 7 to 21 are called generation Z. Under age 7 are called generation alpha. So we divided the peoples into different generation. X, Y, Z and alpha categories. We are handling this generation now. Generation Z. The characteristics of generation Z Divide their attention between millennials and generation Z. Millennials people are watch two screens at a time. Generation Z watch up to five screens at a time. They can use five different gadgets at a time. See the millennials generation people communicate with Text messages. Text. Generation Z people communicate with images plus text. They can easily communicate multimedia text messages. Millennial people are optimists, stand out. They can do what they will say, they can do. They have optimist character. Generation Z people are realistic. They have personal success. 
focus on their success. Millennial people are curate and share, create new applications and platforms. Focus on the present. Generation Z people are produce new content. They want to produce new content. Share existing platforms and applications. <laughs> they focus on future. Generation Z people are focused on future. Millennials peoples are focused on teamwork oriented within a small group. But Generation Z people have a global collective consciousness. They want to connect globally. They want to work with global people. If we ask, uh, now we ask uh, school students, Hi, how was school today? They immediately reply, you can read all about it my, on my blog or my Instagram, my Facebook, my WhatsApp status. They replied. But in past generation, we need to take the classwork note, homework note, what was done in that classroom. But immediately they post their status about the class, homework, everything, share it in the, their blog or WhatsApp, email, Twitter, <coughs> etc. They are using the digital social media platforms easily. So they called Generation Z and Generation Alpha. What is your learning style? What is your learning style? Just answer A, B or C. In B, after this slide, I am having three kinds of learning styles. First one, visual learners. Visual learners, 29 percentage, remember images, shapes and colors only. Second type is auditory learners. Auditory learners, 34 percent, remember voices, sounds and music. They called audi auditory learners. Then third kind of learning style is kinesthetic learners. Kinesthetic learners is do it. More, give more importance to what they want to do. 37 percentage remember by doing, moving and touching. So the, there are three learning styles. Which learning style you are following? Visual learners or auditory learners or kinesthetic learners? Just type A, B or C in your chat box. Which type of learning style you are? Okay. So there are three learning styles which we want to see. The images, shapes and colors, they are having 29% remembrance only. 34% remembrance, we, what we hear it, that have 34% remembrance. What they doing, what they touching, what they moving, that learning remembrance in nearly 37%. So all are giving more importance to this kinesthetic learning style only. Teaching strategies. Teaching strategies mean those procedures and methods by which objectives of teaching are realized in the class. Which objectives of teaching are realized in the class? Teaching strategy means what we realized or 
generalized plan for a lesson which includes structure in structural objectives and an outline of planned tactics necessary to implement the strategy that called teaching strategies for reaching our learning outcomes and objectives what are the procedure we are going to apply in the classroom that is called teaching strategy what are the strategy or techniques or tactics or methods we are applying implementing what we planned in our class that is structured or instructional planned or unplanned activities is called teaching strategy yesterday we we discuss about this cone of learning egg the tail cone already we know that already discuss about passive learning and active learning more percentage 90 percentage of our remembrance what we say and do the benjamin franklin said tell me and i forget teach me and i remember involve me and i learn so involve the students in the classroom activities we interact with them during the class lecture then only they can learn easily they don't forget life long so this also we know that interactive interactive means mutually or reciprocally active mutually means student and teacher interactive mutually with them or reciprocally active interactive both of them talk about that topic interact teaching means engage students in teaching engage them not only telling or saying uh, about that concept teach the concept engage them engage in that activity is called teaching engage students in teaching is called teaching interactive teaching means involves facilitated and learners both it involve teacher and student encourage and expect learners to participate it expect the students participation in the class use questions to stimulate discussion emphasizing the value of answers they realize they can also stimulate motivate to discuss asking the questions the power of questions and answers give participants hands on experience do some give some opportunity to do some activity hands on activity hands on training any experience use teaching aids to gain and retain attention if when we use teaching aids visually or auditory or both any real objects technology aids we can use means they can retain their attention we gain their attention towards the classroom activities concept where to start interactive teaching start with clear learning objectives and outcomes first we clear means uh, clearly decide what are the objectives of today's class first frame the objectives and learning outcomes in after completing this concept topic what are the what are the outcomes we need from expect from the students we design we frame the objectives and outcomes then follow and outline and provide copies to participants 
to circulate these subjects and outcomes to them i expect you these are the behaviors and uh, changes outcomes from you i expect from this class then increase participation students participation we need to increase all the students participation in the class each and every one want to need to should participate in that activity a research so people will listen for only 15 to 20 minutes less than 10 minutes only without a break after 10 minutes or 15 minutes their attention will be deviated they not focus on the listening learn more when given an opportunity to process what they are learning give more opportunity to process what they learning retain more if they review or use the information immediately after learning it what they learned today we give opportunity or give experience to do that what they learned what they listen after learning that class use the information what gain today and give more retain if they review what they learned yesterday today about that information concept points to keep in mind when use interactive techniques and teaching techniques lowest retention value of all teaching techniques lowest retention value of all teaching techniques make more interactive by involving the group by frequently stopping and asking questions frequently stopping and asking questions ask them to ask questions relevant to the concept give the answer to extra points what they know about that we follow we strive for a 30 and 70 percentage formula 30 70 split 30 percentage for lecture our lecture about that concept give allow 70 percentage of time to allow active discussion about that lecture if you have one hour lecture time means the teacher facilitated use 30 percentage of time to lecture about that concept 70 percentage of time to allow them to interact actively participate in any activity discuss about that topic we follow the formula 30 70 percentage interactive teaching strategies is a pattern of communicational strategies which promote active student involvement in the learning process it promote active student involvement it's a communicational strategy pattern to promote active students involvement in the learning process it engages students actively in the class in the topic in the information they gained they are able to do the confirmation of that understanding level in that interactive teaching strategies are there these are the some of the web tools for interactive learning method h5p focusy pictochart edmodo moolly knowledge vision canva prezi wismi pictodeck kagut mentimeter testmos 
Evernote, OBS and Jamboard etc. So many web tools are available. Now here I am going to use one tool H5P for interactive learning methods. I put it in this link into your chat box. You can click this link, H5P link. You can click this link and it will go to a separate window of interactive video about. I prepared a concept, interactive concept about Mahatma Gandhi. You can play this concept. Can you play? We are going to. So, this is a prepared content, e content prepared by me. It's teaching about that concept, uh, Mahatma Gandhi, while teaching. So, at the time of uh, teaching interactively, they, I prepared some questions during this video. So, the questions I put it in that. So, while they playing this, see Mahatma Gandhi. Can you hear this? So, this is a second. play They ask about on questions about that concept. Gandhi was born on. I teach that Gandhi born 1869 uh, October 2. When you click the correct answer, it will move to that, continue to that next level, next uh, concept. If you giving gave the wrong answer means they expect to correct you after giving the correct answer only they move to the next here you click this questions they ask gandhi born in borpandar true or false questions if you give a uh, wrong answer means i click false then i click check here here see the Point zero. If I gave you a wrong answer, means it give wrong. Then we see we can see the solution or right answer or try again. We give the right answer, then check the answer. It will move continue to the next topic, next content. In this way, like drawing out of the best. Here another one interactive questions are that Gandhi saints of education is. Yes. You click, you give that answer here. The more development. We can give the wrong answer means we can see the solutions which is correct. If you gave the wrong uh, spelling mistake also that will give that wrong answer. The solution gave development, non literacy. This is the correct answer. Then we try again. Development, not literacy. Check the answer. Otherwise, move to the next question. Body, mind, and spirit. In this way, we can prepare this interactive content. Four H, we put it on here, head and heart. Okay. Fill in the blanks. So, so first uh, immediate aims of it, Gandhi's education means to develop relation to the aim of education is liberation. So can you play? Uh, 
So, इधर ये play पंड्रिंग ला इन the interactive video में. Dear participants, dear teachers. And from where the pursuits of the soul. These two kinds of liberation is stress, spiritual living. Dignity of labor. So, first we prepare this. Video, e-content video we prepared. Then in the middle we can ask some questions. What are the kinds of uh, different type of questions? Within the blacks, two or false answers, the best answer we can decide which ans which questions we want to ask to them to that relevant topic concept. We frame that, and after preparing this, we can share it to the students. In this concept, okay. A time cards ki moza the open bani par na. We is wrong by dusting haru ko. Then some of the strategies, interactive teaching strategies. It involves facilitator and learners encourage and expect learners to participate. Use hot questions to stimulate discussion, emphasizing the value of answer. It gives learners hands-on experience. Use teaching aids to gain and retain attention. Examples of interactive strategies. The first example is total physical response (TPR). So, मुनाले नम्मे ओर nearly twenty thirty years back, teachers are used this strategy. आफ्टरनून टाइम लाला नमक कुछ तू कवर इंद सोशियल क्लास दला मध्यान ऐरंगल वही की मुद्दे तमिल सोशियल लाम वही की मुद्दे तू कवर टीचर्स चलवांगे हिंदी ची उकार रहते स्टैंड सिट स्टैंड सिट दिस आर द फिजिकल रेस्पोंस एक्टिविटी इंटरैक्टिव स्ट्रेटजी वन ऑफ द इंटरैक्टिव स्ट्रेटजी फॉर दैट � if that is true means it false means stand up true or false we can ask any we can use any kind of words sit stand or true or false or hazard or risk anything else if you state any scenario or events and the students will choose whether it is hazard or risk ulle veliye andha maadhiri velaiyaduvaanga ulle veliye ukkarunga endinga true or false thanni thara andha maadhiri illaadu this are the interactive strategy, one of the example of interactive strategy. And this, the like, nowadays they are using the Facebook, Instagram, etc. So many applications in, in that have like or dislike. Some emojis are there. They are using about this. When the correct answer are like, then give this them. Symbols. This is version 2.0. TP or total physical responses activities. Nowadays, so many this generation are using this kind of activity. And replace discussion boards in that Facebook. We create Facebook group, private or invite only, and use wall as the class discussion board. Students are notified by home page notification when someone replies to their thread. Nowadays, we, can, we are all of them using this Facebook. We create a group, private or individual group, and use small as a class. We have the discussion board. We, we can use that. Do, in the point of education, that is most important thing. Education, educational current issues and concerns, current topics, we can use. Ask uh, any any topic we can ask, discuss about that, expect the information about that, interact about them. They reply easily. answer But in the platform, they can 
give their replies immediately. So many groups we can create in the separate department wise, major wise, topic wise we can create and use. That is most important thing, we closed, we choose privacy. Privacy group we can. The another one example of interactive strategy is Twitter. Report from the field. Students use smartphones nowadays to record their observation while witnessing an event location related to the course of study, capturing more honest and spontaneous reactions. They immediately record what they see, what they observe and immediately shared it to them. So we, re we ask them to strictly capture the more honest and spontaneous reaction only. Use the re educational concept only. We ask them to use properly, safely. Like Facebook, we have also created here a group, a page and use them, ask them to give their announcement, notification or questions, discussion about that concept. Another example of interactive strategy is YouTube, video demonstrations. Using a webcam, record a demonstration relevant to your topic and post it to YouTube. It's a popular and effective, very less cost of to YouTube. What their project relevant activity, their demonstration, their, what they found, what they discover, invent, that activity, they record it and post it in their platform, YouTube platform. We give comments, like on comments and share them, what they did. This is also one of the interactive strategies. We have another example of interactive strategy is student videos. Students' projects, presentations or speeches can take the form of video instead of PowerPoint and upload for the class to see. For this, we, have, we can upload it in that our blog or YouTube or Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, anything else. Their presentations, their uh, projects, their speeches, their achievements, we can record it and upload it in that platform. We can give the comments, suggestions immediately to them. At any time we can see them, anytime, anywhere we can see their students' video. For that we need the camera only. All of, nowadays all of them having the smartphone. Another example, picture prompt. We show a picture to the students. Show students an image with no explanation. We just show the picture only. And ask them to identify or explain it. And justify their answers. See the pictures and say your explanations. Ask them to say explanations about that picture. And ask them to justify their answers or ask students to write about it using terms from lecture or to name the process and concept shown. Also works well as group activity. Do not give the answer until they have explored all options first. Ask them to write or say the answers 
based on the picture or individual activity or group activity we can plan after all the all the students are gave the answer means the facilitator can explain what actually it was this is another example of interactive strategy we can uh, use instagram ask the students to post tag their achievements any certificates or photos images videos what they prepared what they achieved on today they can we can comment tag them edmodo it's a lms tool like google classroom here also they can post their assignment seminar topics or any presentations we give comment feedback to them also we can ask uh, uh, di here discussion board or the some converse conversation we can arrange a converse conversation among the students posting a question ask them their answers ask the simple questions we can and also use another uh, so many applications are there email or blog google site etc so many this is the blog web wordpress or blog blogspot blogger any of the blog we can use ask them the ask the students to create individual or group blog class blog educational blog and post every day their learning activity what they learned today what they achieved today what they prepared today what they discovered today we can follow and give the comments interact with that topic which is right or wrong which we can do which we cannot do what others did we see that in the world wide we can visit so many blogs and we can create and use successfully examples of interactive strategy handheld response card distribute or ask the students to create standardized card that can help afford as visual responses to instructor questions example green card for true red for false we had we have two card one is green color another one is red color means green for true red for false when we ask a uh, questions it is true means they can show green card if it it is wrong means they can show red color card or hand write a g and letter instead of color we can use any letter this is hand held response card instead of they saying they can show their card code minus 1 this is a, provide a quotation relevant to your topic but leave out of a crucial word anyone we leave a word from that quotation who said are you complete that quotation ask the students to guess what it might be this engages them quickly in a topic and makes them feel invested example working without safety is a dead end from this quotation we leave any important word crucial word ask them to guess it what it will complete the quotation this is 1 minus 1 quotes minus 1 everyday ethical dilemmas present and abbreviated case study with an ethical dilemma related to the discipline being studied so ask them to abbreviated a case study so example social media trending and viral stories any now today 
what are the stories viral among social media can anyone say today what are the trending social media trending is now anybody can you say what are the story are trending today among social media that is nine districts are holidays during rain today is trending on social media so many viral stories are there we take any case study to discuss about that concept this is another one example the next examples of interactive strategies make them guess techniques make them guess techniques introduce a new subject by asking an intriguing questions something that few will know the answer to but should interest all of them accept blind guessing for a while before giving the answer to blind curiosity make them guess by asking your questions ask them to guess what to create interest among the students what it will be somebody knows somebody is do not know. accept all the answers all the guessings after getting all the answers from the students we give that correct answer to that questions this is one of the strategy we can apply in our class another make it personal design class activities or even essays to address the real lives of the individual students any individual persons their personal or educational or their achievement related story we can discuss about that class activity which he done which he achieve which he missed or anything else any individual persons stories we can discuss about that their achievements address address the real lives what they did don't punctuated lectures ask students to perform five steps punctuated lectures during our lectures ask the students to perform follow these five steps listen stop reflect write give feedback listen the lecture then stop thinking about that then reflect on that from the lecture write about that concept and give feedback about that lecture ask them to follow these five steps this is a it becomes self monitoring listeners this strategy become the students self monitoring listeners how will listen the lecture how will reflect how they know how to write how to give feedback write feedback to that lecture we can use this strategy in our class lecture 5 plus 1 that is 5 uh, strategy plus 1 is direct instruction variation where the teacher presents for 5 minutes students share reflect for 1 minute the teacher lecture 5 minutes means as give one minute to the students to reflect about 5 minute lecture this is 5 plus 1 strategy punctuated lectures 5 plus 1 strategy means 5 minutes lecture teacher lecture and 1 minute student reflection time this cycle will repeat during the class 
another strategy is word of the day status of the day in any special day we have any quotations or thought theme or status of the day what is the status on today discuss about the status or bad or any special day select an important term and highlight it throughout the class session working it into as many concepts as possible challenge students to do the same in their interactive activities what is the status on today and discuss about why it you use that highlight or important points about that status or word interact ask them to interact or do any activity relevant to that status or word we can also use this strategy and one sentence summary summarize the topic into one sentence that incorporates all act creatively so for 40 minutes lecture irukudna adha vandu one sentence la solradhukku ask the students it will it create creativity among the students how summarizing the concept very briefly they practice summarizing concept profiles of admirable individuals ask the students to write or prepare a brief profile of an individual in a field related to the course students assess their own values and learn best practices for this field we dis- discuss about the individual or famous personality people's profile so so case to share the profile to them and ask them to prepare a profile of your own and assess their own values what are the best innovative innovations or achievements you have what will you can do ask them to prepare this this is also one of the strategy another wisdom of another after any individual brainstorm or creative activity partner students up to share their results then call for volunteers of students who found their partners work to be interesting or exemplary students are sometimes more willing to share in plenty the work of fellow students than their own work they more interested to push others tell others compare them yourself they more give more importance or willing to share plenty the work of fellow students than their work, own work nama senja velai velai aduthavanga senja velai solradhukku romba interested ah irupanga students avanga ipdi panna adha senjiruka abin na enna senjirken abin solradha vida pakkathil ulla student friend avan enna pannirukka abin solradhukku romba aarvathoda irupanga we encourage them to share wisdom of another person our partner our friend our peer student this is a one kind of interactive strategy the movie video applications in groups students discuss examples of movies videos that made use of a concept or a even discussed in class trying to identify at least one way the movie makers got it right and one way they got it wrong so ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் நம்ம கல்கியினுடைய பொன்னியின் செல்வன் அப்படிங்கிற ப அந்த புத்தகத்தை வாங்கி படிங்க வாசிங்க அப்படின்னு சொல்றத விட அந்த மூவியை பார்த்துட்டு வந்து அதை பத்தி டிஸ்கஸ் பண்ண சொல்லும் பொழுது தே ஹாவ் கிவ் மோ இன்ட்ரெஸ்டட் டு டிஸ்கஸ் அபவுட் தட் மூவி எப்படி தயாரிச்சிருக்காங்க என்ன ரைட்டு என்ன தப்பு அப்படிங்கிறத அந்த கம்பேர் பண்ணுவாங்க கல்கியினுடைய புத்தகத்தை என்ன எழுதியிருக்கு ஒரிஜினலா ரியாலிட்டியா என்ன ஸ்டோரி இதுல என்ன மிஸ் பண்ணிருக்குது என்ன மிஸ் பண்ணல எப்படி பண்ணிருக்கலாம் அப்படிங்கிறத பத்தி So, educational movie 
related on any this we have we can arrange a discussion now you can give the answer i can imagine my future students and myself successfully using interactive methods you can give the answers if it is yes means give a no means b maybe means give s yes, c in your chat box i can imagine my future students and myself successfully using interactive methods if the answer is yes means give a no means give b maybe means give c எதிர்காலத்தில் நம்மளால் என்னால் என்னால் என்னாலே என்னுடைய மாணவர்கள்கிட்டையும் என்னால் இன்ட்ராக்டிவ் மெத்தட்ஸை வெற்றிகரமாக பயன்படுத்த முடியும் அப்படின்னு நான் நினைக்கிறேன் அப்படின்னா ஆம் பயன்படுத்த முடியாது அப்படின்னா கிவ் நோ பயன்படுத்தலாம் அப்படின்னா கிவ் சி டான்சஸ் புட்இன் இன்வர் சேன்பாக்ஸ் The another question is, I believe that student response systems will be useful in my future classroom. இதிர்காலத்தில் என்னுடைய வகுப்பறையில் மாணவர்களுடைய பதில் அப்படிங்கிறது வந்து பயனுள்ளதாக இருக்கும் ஸ்டூடெண்ட் ரெஸ்பான்ஸ் சிஸ்டம் எஸ்ஆர்எஸ் மாணவர்களுடைய பதில் அப்படிங்கிறது அவங்களுடைய ரெஸ்பான்ஸ் ரியாக்ஷன் ரெஃப்ளக்ஷன் அப்படிங்கிறது ரொம்ப பயனுள்ளது அப்படின்னு நம்ம நினைக்கிறோம் அப்படின்னு சொன்னால் கிவ் ஆன்சர் எஸ் ஆர் நோ ஆர் மேபி ஏபி ஆர் சி யூ கேன் டைப் இட் இன் த சாட் பாக்ஸ் ஏபி ஆர் சி ஓகே த லாஸ்ட் டுடே செஷன் வாஸ் interesting and relevant means type a in the chat box just interesting means type b in the chat box or just relevant means give c or uninterested and irrelevant means type d in the chat box i need everyone give the answer to this question a b c or d please the last i conclude my session topic with the word of william arthur ward the mediocre teacher tells the good teacher explains the superior teacher demonstrates the great teacher inspires 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 we inspire the students through our activity through our methodology strategy and techniques we inspire them when we inspire the student students we are the great teacher you decide what we are a mediocre great teacher a good teacher or superior teacher or the great teacher we decide then only they we pre we use the strategy so i ask them to everyone to use interactive based teaching learning methods in our class thank you thanks for everyone to give your attention thank you so much thank you ma'am thank you so much ma'am ma'am yes. ma'am good morning all ma'am excuse me it's time to deliver vote of thanks okay i am aishurya from english department okay thank you so ma'am actually it gives me immense pleasure to deliver a vote of thanks to such an inspiring personality like you dr tanuvathi ma'am thank you so much there is a saying that every woman's success should be an inspiration to another ma'am definitely you are the best role model for us thank you for all your strategies and techni- techniques which have been shared during this session thank you thank you once again ma'am thank you meera madam 
ஐஸ்வர்யா மேடம் थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू सॉरी सर थैंक यू सो मच मैम थैंक यू वेरी मच इट्स वेरी यूजफुल टू ऑल ऑफ अस थैंक यू मैम थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू लॉर्ड थैंक यू एवरीवन थैंक यू सो मच ओके थैंक यू सो मच मैम थैंक यू